This area, San Lazarus, uh, it is listed as a historical site since 1976, so a long time ago. And it has been uh, object of several programs of conservation. But in the early millennium, uh, this area was a little bit abandoned between comma. It was a, a place quite uh, gray, you know, uh, some building without a uh, conservation program uh, uh, start uh, being in ruin and uh, 2H. And unfortunately, we heard about ideas, some quite venturous ideas uh, regarding the possibility of uh, reconstruction. Therefore, this so lovely uh, local uh, uh, district was going to fade out. On the other hand, uh, we were discussing uh, passionately about the uh, creative industries in Macau. Uh, even being written in the political program of the Macau ICR government, but people keep on debating. Uh, so, uh, once I told to some of my friends and colleagues that you are always uh, discussing, talking about uh, these issues, uh, but nobody stepped forward. So I'm going to step forward, I'm going to move to San Lazaro, this uh, beautiful venue called Albergue, uh, means senior ladies or old ladies house. So we kept the original name, Albergue uh, das Velhinhas, the Santa Casa de Misericordia. And we move on in the year 2008, September more specifically. And we start uh, doing uh, some works here and start a program in terms of maximizing this area uh, in order to make it a, a culturally uh, active area. On one side, uh, you, uh, we can uh, keep the, this area a cultural heritage. On the other hand, some lifestyle. And uh, delivering also an alternative area for uh, 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 starting of the Millennium Macau, which was starting to be not so proudly as right now, but already with a lot of individual uh, visa tourists. Therefore, this is an alternative for the, the city itself. Yeah.